Okay, this is the specialised camber, and this is a 26 inch wheel version. This is pretty much the standard sort of trail bike that everyone's riding today. And this is the same bike, but with 29 inch wheels. It's the same size frame, an extra large. The frame looks a lot smaller, but that's just because the illusion of the wheels being bigger. The major characteristic is how much more stable you feel, whether you're rolling over bumps or going through a turn. Wherever you are, you're sat in the bike better. And the reason for that is to get the bottom bracket low enough for the handling to feel good, otherwise you'll be way up in the air. The bottom bracket looks low on this bike, but it's actually in relation to where it would be on a 26. 26 inch wheel bike, your bottom bracket can only be so low. Reason for that is you're gonna clout your pedals on the floor, you know, especially with a suspension bike where your bottom bracket height is gonna be changing. This is where your body weight is. It's sat here and it's spread between your front and rear axles. On a 29 inch wheel bike, to get this bottom bracket position, the same height has gotta be quite a bit lower than the wheel axles. Lower your centre of gravity, you're gonna be more stable.